Hey, Gavux here. Today, a review of Matt Williams' third baseman car in MLB Show 19, Diamond Dynasty. He hits right-handed. He can also plays shortstop, which is really neat. You know, speed at 55 kind of limits the range there, but that's not terrible. Uh, decent fielding stats. Uh, so for, you can play both third and like third the speed doesn't matter as much and, and you will get some hot shots at you So a little bit slower reaction at 75 isn't ideal you'd I'd, you know want that up over the 90 into the diamond range But feeling itself he, everybody makes errors uh, in this game as we know and he's not bad there So at the dish contact versus righty power versus righty is 95 and 96 lefty's 107 121 He's kind of like a like a Frank Thomas almost, a little bit less than Frank Thomas, but for third base instead of first base. Uh, vision at 92, so it's a little bit lower than like those high 120 vision guys that you also have at third base. You know, the George Brett, Wade Boggs, high vision, high contact guys. So this is more of like a, like a power type of uh, third baseman than those other twos. It's really nice to have uh, that kind of option and ability. He is a World Series reward. I got him from the World Series reward. About 98,000 stubs if you do the buy now, um, if you go ahead and grab him. So... How does he swing the bat? It is pretty solid. I don't think he has what I'd call a glitchy swing, but I think it's fine. I think it's like down the road, middle. Like you, if you get your PC on it, if you get decent timing with him, um, it's gonna go places. I think just the stats themselves just say it will. The problem with this game, as we all know, is when you hit the ball hard, you hit the ball on the knob, um, you will line it at players. Like not this play, but the play before, I hit the ball pretty darn hard. I thought, but it was right at the shortstop, unfortunately, because I was slightly above it. So, dongers easy right this is like a kershaw killer somebody that you want in i don't know if i recommend like i wouldn't necessarily like platoon him because he can still hit righties pretty solidly but i think you know you can do it if you want if you got like a maybe you have, you have the eddie matthews on your bench but right there just absolute dong shot that was beautiful um he's got a nice little uh, follow through there so yes home runs much easier to hit the ball pops off his bat off lefties really nice uh, I think you're gonna see him face a lot of lefties. I did actually platoon him because I was also I think maybe using George Brett at the same time So Brett might have faced some righties and then Matt was going against lefties So he's really going against his favorable hand here. So that's still popping it up I, I was a little under that as you could tell yourself the swing path the swing like I talked about pretty nice there um, the, the the PCI size like we talked about the contact vision, uh, you know in the 90s uh, pretty good I, I, I liked it, you know, there's anything, there's nothing to complain about there. He does reward good PCI placement, which I think is pretty nice, but like like I said right there, we nailed it, but it was right at it, dude. So it didn't exactly find all the holes, but you know, it. I mean, that's the game, right? So much of this game is just hitting the ball and hopefully it lofts um, up over stuff. So it does have a little bit of a nice uppercut swing to get some power on it. Like I talked about earlier with the fielding, um, you know, at third base, it doesn't really have a ton of range there. Doesn't really need it at third base because the ball's coming so hot at you. But got okay arm, okay reaction, a little bit lower than that you like to. Um, but overall, with the speed, contact, vision, um, hit animations, all that stuff, third base, I say go ahead and grab him. But the problem is he is expensive. And do I think he's worth that extra, what, 30, 40k over Boggs and Brett? Um, it's tough to say. I, I don't think so, but. Shoot, it's so nice to have power in this game um, and hit home runs like that. But go ahead and grab Williams if you want to try him out. Otherwise, I don't think he's a need. Thanks for watching Call to Action. I'll see you tomorrow.